When a fishing reel sits for a long time with monofilament or fluorocarbon line on it, you'll notice that the line develops into these tight coils that are the size of the spool that the line is wrapped around. And these coils are going to decrease the number of fish that you catch. What happens is, when the line is nice and straight and you get a bite, you'll either see the line jump on the water or you'll feel it in your rod tip. And when the line is coiled, all that's going to happen is it's going to stretch the coils a little bit. You're probably not going to see the line movement at all. You're not going to feel it in your rod tip because the line isn't even tight. So you're going to miss a lot of bites that way. What you want to do is get rid of those coils by stretching out the line, especially at the beginning of each season. So what I'm going to do today is I'm going to hook this little swim bait into the boards of this bench. And I'm going to walk backwards, holding some tension on the line so my lure doesn't fall out of there. And I'm going to hand feed line out with the bail open. And I'm going to walk back about as far as I could cast with this rod right now. So I could probably get back to about where that first big rock is back there. So I'm going to walk down the driveway until I get to that first rock. And I'm going to keep some tension on the line and stretch out this line. All right, I'm just gonna hold the pole like this for about 15 seconds. It might look like I'm pulling really hard on the line right now, but I'm really not because monofilament has so much stretch. But I wanna keep a lot of tension on it to make sure that it straightens out. So after 15 seconds, I'm just gonna walk back to the bench. I'm gonna reel as I go, and I'm gonna keep this pole bent. All right, as you can see, when I have slack in the line now, there are no coils. Hopefully this helps you catch more fish. Thanks a lot for watching. We'll catch you next time.